Breaking and tragic news this morning. Another teen is dead following a pair of accidents involving teens falling through thin ice. In the first incident, three teens fell into the icy water in East Brunswick. Two managed to escape. Tragically, one did not. Then two more teens went under in Carteret. One was safely rescued, but we just learned moments ago that second did not make it. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller is live in Carteret. Derek. Just a devastating morning for this family here in Carteret. Uh, we just got that news from a relative a few minutes ago uh, that a 15 year old boy who fell through the ice here off of Carteret Avenue last night passed away at the hospital overnight. His aunt uh, just giving me that terrible news uh, just a few minutes ago. We have some video from this scene last night. Uh, this uh, terrible scene two teenagers fell through that ice. One was able to get out, but the second, 15 year old, David Tilburg. Uh, he was not able to escape and uh, he was eventually taken out of the ice, uh, taken out of the water, taken to uh, the University Hospital in Newark, and that is where he died overnight. Uh, paramedics uh, doing their best to try to resuscitate him. I looked to the fire truck to see uh, the ambulance, to see who it was, and it was, uh, they were resuscitating the kid for sure more than 30, 35 minutes to an hour, for sure, guaranteed. Absolutely. And that's the sad part. It's a young kid. And we're also covering another deadly, tragic situation in East Brunswick. That's where three other teens fell into a different icy pond right on Civic Center Drive in the heart of town around 5 last night. Two of the 13-year-old boys were able to escape, but despite first responders' best efforts, the third boy, an eighth grader at Churchill Junior High School, died. And again, the breaking news we just learned a few minutes ago that a 15-year-old boy uh, who fell into this pond behind me here in Carl Carteret. Uh, he died at the hospital overnight as well. He was a, a student at Carteret High School.